Tractor land, what a fun place to be Lots to do and so much to see Tractor Ted here, come on let's go Down to the farm to watch things grow I'm Tractor Ted and my colour is green At the end of the day I'm washed till I'm clean Tractor Ted here, come on let's go Down to the farm to watch things grow Hi, my name's Tractor Ted and I live in Tractorland. Today, we're going to see how Christmas trees are grown. There is a lot of work to do to get them ready for Christmas time. This is the Christmas tree farm. What a lot of trees there are! Fudge and Midge have come along too. They love running about and sniffing everything. They're so small, they can run right under the trees. Oh, where have they gone now? Ah, there they are. <laughs> they are having fun. These Christmas trees are very tall but it takes time for them to grow this high. Let's see some which have just been planted. Here they are. The trees are planted when they are three years old. They are still quite small. Les and Barnaby are clearing the weeds from around the young trees. Fudge and Midge are helping too. Now they are in the ground, the trees will grow very quickly. Let's go and see some taller ones. There isn't very much room between them now. Who's that coming through the trees? It's Barnaby. He's using a special machine to spray in between them. It's a very tight squeeze driving through the trees. Up and down he goes. He has to watch out for big branches. Oh, oh, oh! Oh look, there's Les. I wonder what he's doing. He's cutting off some of the branches. This is called pruning. It helps the tree to grow into a good shape. This long bit at the top is called a leader. At Christmas, do you put an angel or a star on yours? Sometimes, cheeky birds come and sit on them, and then they break off. So Les clips a stick on the tree. He hopes the birds will sit on that instead. Les has got the tractor and trailer out. He's going to show us how they cut down the trees. Here he comes. There's a tree which hasn't grown properly, so they're going to cut it down. They carefully drive the cutter off the back of the trailer. Well done. Barnaby steers the machine into place. The big blades close together and cut through the trunk. 
Good job. Someone has ordered a tree, so they're going to go and get it ready for them. Barnaby brings over the netting machine. The trees are put in nets to make them easy to carry. That's too big for that. The netting machine has three different sized holes. They turn the ring round to line up the biggest one. That looks like it will fit. It doesn't take long to cut it down. Les brings it over to the machine. In it goes. And there it is, wrapped up. It looks very neat and tidy. I hope you've enjoyed finding out more about how Christmas trees grow. See you again soon. Bye.